Hi, and welcome to Health 101. I'm so glad you're here. I'm going to give you a brief story about USANA's founder, Dr. Myron Wentz. He started Gold Laboratories and is famous for his test kits used to diagnose infectious disease, like mono, Epstein-Barr, and others. But when he started losing family members to de degenerative diseases like cancer and heart attacks, he decided to change his focus from diagnostic to prevention. The principles of good nutrition are universal. If we can nutrient the human body in a comprehensive way on a daily basis with a full spectrum of essential nutrients in the right forms, amounts, and in the proper balance, we can sustain long-term health and effectively avoid degenerative disease. Health, after all, must begin at the cellular level. This is how USANA was started, by a scientist with a passion. His passion continued to grow, and in 1999, he started Sana V. It's a health and healing resort. This is a state-of-the-art facility that focuses on your health. Their focus is the whole body at a cellular level. People from all over the world come here to regain their health, as well as just maintain their health. He also started the True Health Foundation, and their mission is helping humanity. This is my sister, Becky. She went to Sanofi Medical Institute for comprehensive testing. What they found was she was on a path to self-destruct. What they told her was you are a healthy woman with some serious health issues. If we can reverse the health issues, you'll just be a healthy woman. Her insulin levels at that time were 180, but after following the plan they set out for her, within 13 days, she was able to bring her insulin level down to 90. That's a healthy level. She did this by changing her lifestyle, not by becoming dependent on drugs. There is a link below that tells about her story. Now, Dalai Lama, he said what surprises him most is that we will sacrifice our health in order to make money. But then we have to sacrifice our money just to recover our health. Now, this is crazy. So what do you think your body's worth? And I don't mean infinite. I mean, what is it worth on the black market? If you donated your organs, they're worth about $45 million. Wow, did you know you were so valuable? But what if you could donate your brain as well? Well, have you ever seen a computer that could do what your brain does? It's not available. Your brain alone would be worth over $5 billion. So now you know how valuable you are. You should have known it already. But think about this. What do you do to protect your body? Are you taking care of it? You know, knowing it's worth over a billion dollars, are you taking that kind of care for it? You know, we each month we'll pay money for a car insurance. We'll pay money for health insurance, home insurance. We do all these things to protect things that we own. Don't you think you're worth more than these possessions? I do. Daily, we're exposed to toxins, whether it's pollution, radiation, stress, toxins that we bring on ourselves. You know, we know that smoking cigarettes will increase your risks of having cancer. So don't you believe that if you changed your lifestyle, that you did things that were healthy, that this could increase your chance of becoming healthy? I think this is a good investment in yourself. You know, vegetables and fruits are great antioxidants. But are we getting everything we need from our foods? You know, our ancestors used to eat a lot of 
fruits and vegetables, but they were grown locally. They were picked fresh, eaten that same day. The nutrient value was much higher. The produce we get nowadays is picked so far in advance. We don't do crop rotations. The quality of our fruit and vegetable is not the same. I think it is very important to still eat our fruit and vegetables, but we need more. We have become a drive through society. We suffer from chronic drive through fatigue. Our health is suffering because of this. We're, we're eating highly processed, sugar-laden foods, sometimes two and three times a day. So where do you think this is going to take us? Unfortunately, to lifestyle diseases. Diseases of cardiovascular, cancer, stroke, respiratory, and diabetes. You know, I'm sure we all know people who have suffered from these lifestyle choices. Doesn't it make sense that we do everything we can to protect our body? I think it's a great plan. So what do you think health really is? You know, it's not just the absence of symptoms. It is the absence of disease. You know, if you had a headache and you take a painkiller, you still have that headache. The pain is just blocked. This is not health. The same is true with other diseases like cancer. This will grow undetected for years. Um, heart failure. Maybe your first sign is going to be a heart attack. Diabetes. This, again, grows slowly until the symptoms are shown and sometimes at this point it's too late. We need to do everything we can to stay healthy. So here's one example. We get mammograms. We get pap smears. We get prostate checks. These are things we can do to protect our health by early detection. Now we all know these are important things to do, but we need to go further than this. This is my nephew, Casey. He suffered a heart attack. You know, he was way too young to have this kind of a problem. In the hospital, he decided to make some changes. He wanted to be sure he was going to be here for his wife and for his daughter. And he decided to get healthier, to make some lifestyle changes. You know, but does it take this kind of a traumatic thing to happen in our lives before we make these kind of changes? I sincerely hope not. Some important changes we need to make are not only what we eat, we need to reduce stress. So many people are under stress because of finances. You need to look at ways to relieve this stress as much as possible. Just like Dr. Oz, we are focused around getting healthier. This is our way of life, our, the way we eat, all these things are so important if you want your whole body to be healthy. But are we getting the nutrients we need to win this fight? I don't think we can from our food. Did you know that 86% of the U.S. population is not meeting their nutritional requirements daily? 86%. This is the most important factor in preventing cardiovascular disease and cancer. You say you don't feel anything from vitamins. Well, do you feel anything from cancer? It's the most important thing to supplement. And look, just this one vitamin, vitamin E. You would have to eat enormous amounts of food just to get this one vitamin. It is so important to supplement. Part of the reason might be we're being lied to. You know, I don't think they're doing it purposely to hurt us. They're doing it to sell their products. 
They're saying Ritz crackers has less fat. Well, did they tell you that um, they took the fat out, but they added more sugar or more salt? Vitamin water, do you think this is nutritious? No, I don't think so. But they use the word vitamin to make us think it is. This is marketers. They're using this to advertise. Even when it comes to our supplements, you have to be careful. This is a children's supplement. First ingredient, sugar. Second ingredient, sugar. A lot of artificial colors. Um, different things are inside there. Colorings. And then we get down to some vitamins. More. Blue number one. Red number 40, then there is a vitamin. I would like to be a little bit more careful what I give to my children. Athletes know that their bodies are their livelihood. The vitamins that they choose must be good. And there are over 3,000 athletes, I've heard, that take the USANA vitamins. And why do they choose USANA? because it can be trusted. The Women's Tennis Association told their people, if you want to take a vitamin, we will only allow you to take USANA. Because if they're found with a substance that is um, not allowed in their body, they'll lose their medal. The whole team can lose their medal. It is that important and they allow their athletes to take USANA. USANA has given a $1 million athlete guarantee. If any athlete is found with a substance in their body due to the fact that they took USANA products, USANA will give them a $1 million. Well, I don't think they would offer that if they had any worry that, that they would have to pay because they know their products are clean. And not only are they clean, did you know that 54% of the vitamins that are in tablets, they don't even dissolve? So you'll put it in one end and it comes out the other and your body can't use anything of it because it never even dissolved in your body. This is pretty sad. With the USANA vitamins, you know you won't have that problem. We follow GMP manufacturing, that's good manufacturing practices. We follow pharmaceutical grade practices. That means your product is going to dissolve. The truth is we're really good at what we do. And not only do we know that, others know that. The NutraSearch guide looked at over 1,600 different products and USANA was rated number one. Yusana's vision is huge. We dream of a world that's free from pain and suffering, a world free from disease. Now this is so monumental, so huge, but this is our goal. We want to love life and live it to its fullest in happiness and health. But we even go beyond that. Not only do we want to make the best vitamins, the best skin care, the best um, nutritional macronutrients, micronutrients, we want to be good to the environment. USANA has gone green. You know, I love this. Everything we do helps you love life and live it. Our call to action is... Do everything you can to protect your body from degenerative diseases. You know, the person who shared this with you really must care about you. It is so important to nutrient your body at the cellular level. Get your body healthy. Make your body take care of itself. You know, get back with the person who showed you this and let them know your interest. Thank you for listening.